Zooming in on matters North Africa, the United States Embassy compound in the Libyan capital, Tripoli, has been raided by militiamen. But no Americans were present as the embassy was evacuated more than a month ago. Now, the attack on Sunday comes as fighting between rival militias rages on in Tripoli and Benghazi, the second city in the east. Even though the U.S. has suspended its mission in Tripoli for the second time in three years since July, the U.S. Secretary of State John Kerry has said that the embassy was not closed and its staff has been evacuated to neighboring Tunisia. The U.S. ambassador to Libya said the embassy was being safeguarded and had not been ransacked. In February 2011, the embassy suspended operations amid the uprising that eventually toppled longtime leader Muammar Gaddafi. After the formation of a transitional government in July 2011, the embassy reopened in September. The Obama administration has been particularly sensitive about security of U.S. government employees in Libya since the September 11, 2012 attack on the U.S. mission in Benghazi that killed Ambassador Chris Stevens and three other Americans. Tripoli has been embroiled for weeks in intermilitia violence that has killed and wounded dozens on all sides.